Hi everyone, so this is Catfish Season 7, Episode 5, called Mary and Adam. Uh, we don't know this yet, but the person who's writing in is Mary, and the catfisher that she, the person she's worried about is Adam. So in this email, someone's writing in, saying that they're being catfished, but doesn't want to say, reveal who they are, because uh, Neve and Max caught them catfishing before. So, uh, this person met Adam three years ago on Facebook, and they think uh, it might be Mary from Pensacola, because of the the person he's freaking in the email it's not her but anyway uh they've been on and off but are now together um adam knows about her and her and accepts her past um, and everything was fine until they started to notice things adam uh was doing that they themselves used to do while they were being a catfish um like they've never video it before so they call the person on skype um who Um, who wrote in, and it's actually Mary from, it's another Mary, um, it's a, it's a completely different Mary, and she, um, you know, continues, she starts kind of about where it all started, and she's like, well, uh, when I met him on Facebook, he was going by the name Cameron because he and his mom are estranged, and he didn't want her to contact him or know where he was, um, and he had, apparently has joint custody of his sister, uh, alongside his grandparents, uh, video chatting is something he does, and when they, sh sh would, at, when she would ask of him about, about it, he would always say, well, I'm having an ugly day, or some shit like that, uh, he lives in Alabama, um, and, and I, they don't say where, but, um, at least I don't remember where they say, um, and, like, he's making all these excuses not to let her visit. Um, Neve asks if Adam isn't the guy in the pictures, if it would matter, uh, what, uh, if it would matter to her. And she's like, um, no, it wouldn't. It wouldn't matter. Um, but, uh, she wouldn't accept him if he was over 40 years old. Insert biggest eye lover. So, they, okay, so what I don't get is they fly her out to L.A. instead of them going to her in, Can in Kansas or something like that. So they pick her up, go to a coffee shop, start, uh, they, um, and she's like, well, we started talking almost immediately. And he told her he loves her to, like, started telling her he loves her, like, two years before. And, like, uh, so they look through pictures of Adam and he, and one of them is, Adam in the doctor's office, and she's like, well, he has mouth cancer. Uh, so, right off the bat, Neve is like, really? Come on. You should know. Right off the bat, that that is a red flag. Um, she says she's done some research by looking at his pic pictures, which came up, which didn't show anything, and his number, um, and his number came up to his profile. Um, he, he gave her his username and password for so, certain social medias, um, so, to, just, to, just so that, you know, she could trust him and all that, so they take her to her hotel before they start investigating. Uh, once they start investigating, they start some photos, I mean, didn't she say that she didn't find anything? with the with the photos so why are they looking at the photo why why are they running the photos and they run the phone number and she she said the same like she's also said look i ran the van the phone number but i found it came back to his profile so why are they running this like <laughs> what are you doing okay um uh and i wanna I, I don't remember if like it was before this or during this invest this part this investigation part or if it was uh after this but neve uh at some point says i don't trust her i don't trust mary i i i think like because the roles are reversed this this time neve thinks that um uh mary is lying and lying about something and feels like she's is she's in on it this whole thing um because, um, I guess because of everything that doesn't sound plausible and, um, and everything that they find doesn't sound fine later uh, after this point, uh, um, uh, seems plausible that she just didn't know and, 
Max is the one who's like, well, he, he doesn't say that he doesn't believe her, but he doesn't say that he does believe her. Um, and I'm just like, I personally, throughout this whole episode, I I believed Mary uh, from Jump Street. I believed her. Um, I felt like she was being genuine, um, which was true if you saw the whole episode. So um, anyway, so go, going back to the um, investigation part, look at his uh, current page, and uh, he has mentioned a girl named Skylar on there in one of his posts. Skylar makes a comment on said post saying December can't come quick enough, which sounds like they were uh, they are supposed to meet up uh, after um, later on after this episode was being filmed. Um, they look at her profile and feel she's real, so they reach out to her and they change up the script this time, saying that her friend Adam is fake to beat her. So they go to the Cameron page and find Mary's picture as a timeline photo. Um, and the Cameron page feel that they feel like it's very much like uh, it feels very much like he's just looking for compliments on that one. Uh, so they use a website called Nexus.com to search for Adam, uh, his whole name. Uh, obviously, I don't know his last name because I mean they don't they don't allow that um, on their show. So they run his name and find two Adams in Alabama with that specific last name. One of them is 40, and the other is 43. Um, So yeah, here is Neve. Okay, so here Neve says like I feel like Mary is catfishing because as a chronic catfisher, uh, because she she's a chronic catfisher and here she is conveniently falling for for a catfish. So I just like I said I feel like Neve after because um, this is episode five. So I I feel like after four previous episodes or uh, filming four previous episodes episodes where the cat the person feel uh, thinking they're being catfished was a, had a shit personality after seeing that four times in a row he i guess he feels like kind of trampled on or beat down or whatever at, by this and so um and d- d- does just doesn't want to believe a person thinking they're being catfished because, you know, I mean, what if they're they're lying about something now? Like, what if they're lying now and we're just being too gullible or whatever? And, because it was, it was like a complete 180 from the last episode. And it's just like, anyway, so just then, um, they get a call from Skylar and they FaceTime. Max is like, well, uh, he doesn't want to... tell Skylar's, uh, Skylar Mary's story because it's like, you know, for whatever reason, he doesn't explain exactly why, but he just doesn't, uh, tell Mary's story at the moment, um, so, he's like, well, just tell us your, your story, she's like, I'm 17, from North Carolina, I met, uh, uh, Adam on Facebook, um, and we're dating, um, and she plans, she plans on meeting him on December 11th, um, she said she videotaped it with him one time, but it was, uh, late at night and dark at the time, and, um, so she's like, why do you think he's a catfish? And so Max explains that he doesn't show any interest in proving who he says he is, and has an interest in speaking to and dating multiple women. So they let her know they will fill her in on what they find, which they don't see them ever doing, um, because... Which is like, anyway, uh, the next day they meet with Mary at a park. They die uh, before they dive in. Uh, she's like, um, we talked about marriage, and then Max, or and then um, Neve tells her of her concerns, or, or his concerns, and so they then tell her what they found, and they show her Skylar's cop, and she says she has never seen them before. So that means she has been blocked on. Um, she has been blocked on uh, Facebook from seeing Skylar, um, and Skylar's the only person who has the power to do that, as far as I know. I mean, unless Adam has Skylar's uh, u- uh, um, username slash email and password to log into Facebook, and then you know ban 
Mary from seeing Skylar's page and therefore uh, Skylar's comments on Adam's page. I don't know. Um, that's a viable option. But as far as I know, Skylar's the only one who has the power to uh, um, power to um, keep Mary from seeing her her profile and subsequent comments. So. Uh, <clears throat> So they then break the news that Skylar is under the impression that she and Adam are dating. They then tell her of the future meetup and then call Adam um, when they get him on the phone. At this point, I was just thinking that I, I was just thinking that it was a, 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 a person who identifies as a girl um, trying to sound like a guy to throw them off. Um, I mean, I changed my mind. I changed my mind later on in the episode um, once I see Adam in the flesh, but. Um, uh, I, at this point, I was thinking that it was just a, a person who identifies as a girl trying to sound like a guy, like a sister and a girl trying to f sound like a guy. Um, <clears throat> doesn't agree to me at first, then does agree. So, before they go, um, so they, the next day they fly to Alabama, um, Neve texts Adam to see where they can meet up, but he in turn texts Mary saying, instead saying he is busy all day. So they have Mary ask the next day would be good to meet, and he's like, well, I'll have to get back to you on that. So the following day, they try to call, uh, try calling Adam, but he doesn't answer. Um, Nee, uh, Max then, um, gives Mary one last chance to, excuse me, to tell them if she has been lying about anything. She's like, I haven't been lying. And like I said, this entire time I've been thinking, you know, she she legit feels like she she is telling the truth about everything. And I uh so they did try calling again, he answers and says that he will meet in half an hour. Uh they get to the house and Adam walks out. Um and at this point I was like, he's transgender. I can tell he is transgender. I mean I mean, it's his prerogative to reveal that, but I could, t I could tell, like, it felt like, it. and so Max asks what his deal is, because things aren't adding up, and he's, then he reveals, I'm, I'm a, a, a female to male transgender, um, and he says he didn't say anything because Mary doesn't have a filter on Facebook, but Mary is quite upset about that because Adam could have just asked to not ask her to not share that, and she would she wouldn't have shared it. Um, and I suppose I can see where he would be concerned, um, but you also have to ask what information does she not have a filter on because she could have a she could not have a filter on certain certain information but have a filter for other things like uh not outing someone who is trans and stuff so i mean it, it probably it would have been better if you just asked her to not to see like to not like gauge her response first so i, I don't know I mean, I, but I do, I do hear his concerns about not telling her because that could potentially put him in, him in a harm's way, seeing as how he's in the South and all that. So I, I won't go in on him for that. So, um, uh, he says he has plans of leaving Alabama, but he doesn't, but he can't right now because he has to figure his things his, his figure things out and he has joint custody like and he has other responsibilities like you know joint custody of his sister um and he uh says he does have mouth cancer because he used to or he has been putting chewing tobacco in his mouth um for quite a while um but has since cut down on the amount he chews um they confront him about Skylar and he says they're just good friends uh something told me that that was fucking bullshit Cause I was like, something tell told me that was utter fucking bullshit. Cause like, I mean, she wouldn't be laboring under the delusion that she's dating him if she thought that they were just good friends as well. <laughs> like, um, so 
Adam's like, well, I want a relationship, but they need to take it slow because they live so far away. And it's just like, you, I mean, and Mary brings this up, but she, but Adam's just thinking like, yet yeah, you said you were going to move. So, I mean, I, I granted, I get that moving won't happen that fast, but you still plan on moving and leaving the, the state. So, <laughs> like... So I'm just like, okay, uh, what? Um, he says that he wants to date other people here. Uh, if he wants to date other people here, he should, and he wouldn't mind if Mary did it too. And so Mary excuses herself, goes to the car, and like is visibly visibly upset. Um, Max goes to the car with her, and it's like, um, And so when they're at the car, Neve asks Adam what he want, what he wants, and he's like, "Well, I want, uh, I, I, I just want the relationship as it is, which is just texting and calling, and that's it." So Neve's like, "Well, that isn't really a relationship. Uh, that's really just a friendship." So, uh, and deliberately messing with people and their emotions isn't cool and shit. So, uh, Neve goes to get married so that she can talk with Adam inside privately. Uh, so, in the house, Mary is like, well, I was under the impression that we were dating. Um, but he was like, well, I, did, I didn't mean to give, give you that impression. I just wanted a friendship. Um, but you like okay i still don't get it it's like you i mean you you're saying you don't want to relate uh, like a romantic relationship with her and just a friendship with you just want a friendship with her but you're saying shit like i love you and uh, i want to get married and shit or some something like that and it's like you're saying all this shit and then like you can't say that now and then like expect people to be okay about it like <laughs> so Mary's like, can we go out on a date? And he's like, I can't be seen with you here. And so she just gets up and leaves. Two months later, Maria's gotten her teeth fixed. And we find out later that they, uh, after they left, Adam blocked her on everything. Literally everything. And But the kicker is, Skylar is now his girlfriend. <laughs> and it's just like, but <laughs> weren't you just saying two months ago that you didn't want a relationship with uh with someone because uh, with Mary because you didn't want the distance there but i mean cuz i i i mean i'm assuming that Mary and him are the same or Skylar and him are the same distance away as uh, uh Adam and Mary are so why is it okay for you to want to date her but not not marry so it, it's like <laughs> like what like i mean to that, that's typical guy shit that's that's typical guy shit like you 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 want your like you, you want to have it all you want to have a main chick but then also want to have a side chick and then like <laughs> like it was fine like I mean Skylar's the main chick and Mary's a side chick cause she Mary's gonna do whatever you tell her to 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 do because she she's willing to do it because she I mean cause you're stringing her along I mean I just uh, I, I just like and, and 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 what's even more surprising is that this guy like added her on fucking Facebook. It's like what the hell? Like, I I believe that he was dating Skylar this entire time, and he was just like messing with Mary because of the fact that like somehow Skylar and him had a fight or something. I don't know. I mean. It, I mean, it was such bullshit. I mean, I'm glad they're back to painting the cat, the person catfishing as the bad guy instead of the catfish, the person who's thinking they're cat being catfished as the bad guy. So, uh, cause I, I just okay. 
anyway, so next week, or on Wednesday, a guy writes in about a guy named Garrett. Um, I don't know who the guy, who the guy wrote in his name is, but, uh, he seems, from what I remember, he seems pretty upset about something. I just don't know what, because I didn't reveal it, but, uh, so, uh, there's that. So, um, I will see you guys hopefully Thursday for, uh, Catfish.